school are lacing up their sneakers and hitting the streets to help support an ice skating charity. News 4's Joe Arena joins us now with more on this annual event. Hey, Joe. Yeah, it's a great event, Nalina, and uh, Holy Angels Academy is certainly doing its part in making sure the blind and handicapped are getting the attention they deserve. Now, each year, the Academy raises money for the skating athletes bold at heart, or also known as Saba. Our very own Al Vauders, who's on the board for the program, started things off with the squeeze of an air horn. <laughs> like how he covered his ear there. About a 20 minute walk or light jog began. Looks like a pretty brisk morning for that. Also attending this year and different from the past with Sabretooth. It's kind of a silver lining with the Sabres still on strike and the season opener canceled. The team's mascot was able to join today's walk. A walk that organizers say is the product of a tight knit community. The Holy Angels and Saba have had a long history of a great relationship uh, together and they uh, you know, gratefully, we're so grateful every year that they, they do this and there's uh, such a sense of community here and giving back to the community and, and I think that's really what uh, Holy Angels is all about. And because of Holy Angels playing such an active role in helping raise money for student activities and Saba, the Sabres who are very involved in this program were we're told have donated the old Buffalo Bandits turf to the academy so once the skates get put away, the school can play more sports. No